How's everybody doing today? This is DJ with One Time Outdoors and I'm going to do a uh, video review on this tarp. Um, I guess it's kind of initial impressions. I just got the tarp. I just tried to do an unboxing and putting it together but for some reason my camera didn't record the first half so <laughs> here we go um so i am a little disappointed with this tarp um it's an amazon uh choice tarp so if you um If you go to Amazon right now and type in Rainfly for hammock camping, this is Amazon's choice. And it's $36.97 shipped to your door. It says next day shipping, but it took two days for it to get here. It also says that the tarp is 12 foot by 10 foot. Oh. which after I measured it that is not true um, and it comes with a bunch of stuff uh, it comes with the rain fly and then everything came in this bag right here this is the name of the rain fly I'm guessing rainflyevolution.com um, and from what I could find it is sold by best choice products on Amazon so here's the first stuff sack which I mean it's a pretty decent stuff sack you know for what it is it is ripstop nylon um, comes with this, uh, I guess, survivor bracelet. Um, it looks like it has a whistle, a ferro rod, striker, a compass. Um, comes with tent stakes. They're, they are aluminum tent stakes. I'm going to come down here because it's really windy. I don't want the wind to blow all this crap away. Here's your tent stake, or your, you know, stake for the, your bag for the tent stakes and cord. And they do have nice uh, locks on them. These are really good locks, really strong locks. Okay. So it comes with seven lines of cord. I'm guessing ridge line and your four tarp pullouts and they also have these tensioners on them like the little plastic tensioners it comes with six stakes um, like I said they're aluminum I didn't measure these but I will just so you know um, and then it comes with six of these little S beaners. Um, they are metal, some type of metal. And here's here's the you know side view. I like how it's. I like the color. Um, this is their logo. I'm guessing <laughs> it's on both sides of the tarp. And then here it is again on this side. Now, it's supposed to be a, a cat cut tarp, but I know it's hard to tell, especially right now with the wind blowing, but their cuts are very uneven. <laughs> I don't know if you can see it in the video, but like it comes you know along this way 
and then it goes up in the air right here and then comes back down which is you know weird and it's not like that on the other side it it just goes you know pretty much up in the corner and then across and then down um you know this stitching looked actually really good on this tarp you know considering what you pay for it and everything it does have you know i guess this webbing to go around the whole outside for you know strength now i did notice that on the pullouts there is like a double layer to reinforce all the pullouts which i really like i just had a kelty tarp rip on me and you know wasn't even that old and kelty pretty much said screw you you know buy another tarp but um it is what uh it's got a pu coating on it on the inside also has tape seams or tape seam now like i said it looks really nice it's cheap um it's a rip stop you know there's a couple little you know that little defect there it comes with a lot of extra you know stuff now here is where the problems come i measured it and from this point right here from right here to the other side your ridge line it's only 11 foot 5 inches it's supposed to be 12 foot okay so that's that's wrong in the measurements and then I measured from the middle right here from there all the way across to here and it is nine foot two inches and then from right here from this point across to there it is eight foot eight inches and from the center up here from the seam along this way so from the bottom to the top of the seam it's only four foot two inches so I know some people are gonna say you know it's cheap you get what you pay for blah 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 but I don't know I wanted a 12 foot tarp by 10 foot so I guess it is what it is I'll be sending this back I'm not gonna keep it and this is actually the second tarp that I've ordered from Amazon and have to send back within a two week period granted it's my fault for buying less expensive gear but when you're on a budget sometimes that's what you have to do um, if, if this tarp was 12 foot by 10 foot I would love it um, you know it's got holes right here in, in all the tie outs even on the ridge line tie out it's you know decently made except for when it comes to this blemish right here but you know I don't know maybe you could tell me in the comments what you would do would you return the tarp? Would you 
ask the company to send you a different tarp to see if maybe this is just uh you know one in a million chance that I got this tarp that is not true to spec per se or would you just keep it so I look forward to the comments and you know let me know but <clears throat> as always thank yous for watching I appreciate yous watching and when yous like the video and especially when you when you comment and the other day I actually had someone message me back and and said to me you know I watched your review of a tent that you did and it actually helped me to buy the tent and I really like the tent and that made me feel good that I was able to help someone and that's that's all I'm trying to do is um, you know help somebody make a better purchase and there's a lot of stuff I don't know there's a lot of stuff you know I don't I won't be able to test out um, you know just because 90% of the stuff I buy so it's you know stuff that I can afford but anyway thank you for watching please like share and comment and as always have a blessed day